If somebody's a leader, you got recruited after the fact. These are the goals, these are the objectives. This is your job, this is your role, this is your responsibility. You want, if you want to lead, you've got to earn. You, actually, it's not a case of take out the leader and kill him and take his position. That's back in bygone days where the strongest survives. This is the strongest mindset, the best qualified for the job, the most to give is normally now the leader. We hope it's not always the case. But in industry, maybe more so than, let's say, public sector. Sometimes, you know, shit rises to the top. There's no two ways about it. The longest there gets the job because they're the longest surviving. It doesn't mean the youngest isn't the best and is the most innovative and got the best ideas. So if we're not saying it's the right person for the job. We're saying the dynamic, the best dynamic out there is the right people for the right jobs in the right order, positioned well, that, uh, that the actual goals of the firm, uh, of, of the journey align with the goals of the individuals in the terms of the roles that they want for themselves and, and their personal vision aligned with the, with the company vision. So that's what we're doing. We're trying to create the vision. We're trying to align ourselves first to it. When we start staffing up other people, they'll know what the vision is and hopefully they'll want to be part of that vision and align theirs to it. And then we can trailblaze because that mix of people and personalities will be the right mix in each of the roles. Each knows their responsibility, where it crosses over and back and forth, what the day job is, and then what that extra 20% might be in the sense of aligning to the common goal and make a difference beyond the day job. One of the things that's quite important if you read anything on leadership is, is actually not the leader isn't necessarily the one that seems to be in charge. Quite often, the leader is the person in the second or third role who knows how to influence the person above so that the goals can actually be reached. And then they, they're able to come back and then they have the opportunity to come up with other ideas and strategies that they can then influence the person above. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe and click on the bell for notifications.